so um, I'm just popping on. I'm going to be making some soap today and I figured maybe I would share it with you. So um, if you pop on, say hello to me because uh, yeah, I can't really see, I can't really see very well, but I'm hoping that I can see your name. So um, I'm going to be making um, all of my Christmas soaps, well, a portion of my Christmas soaps um, today. Today I'm going to be making um, a charcoal soap that I'm making specifically for Christmas. Um, it's called Licorice Mint. Um, so I'm pretty excited about that one. So I'm just going to get all suited up and everything like that and uh, hopefully we'll have some people join us. safety glasses on and then we got to wear some rubber gloves so even if you guys are watching on the replay um, I know it's a long weekend I know everyone's really busy so please feel free to um, say hello even after uh, and if you have any questions just let me know um, so all right so all my Christmas soaps, they're a little bit of a different recipe than I normally use. Um, my oils, I include hazelnut oil in it. Um, hazelnut oil is really good for moisturizing the skin. Um, and so all of my different seasonal stuff actually goes and uh, it has all different types of oils. So my fall ones um, had pumpkin seed oil in them and these ones are going to have hazelnut. So it's kind of a little exciting, um, makes everything just a little bit different. So this one's going to be a charcoal soap. I'll show ya. So I have all my charcoal um, mixed in oil already. Um, that way it doesn't clump when it goes into my batter. All right, so I will get started. Um, I've had a lot of requests lately for live videos of me making soap, so here it is. I'm making soap. Hi Jasmine, thanks for watching. I'm making um, charcoal soap. I'm making a fall charcoal soap. It's going to smell like licorice mint. So my licorice mint is actually a blend of different essential oils. Um, it is peppermint with anise and vanilla. So it actually smells quite nice. All right, so I'm gonna get started. stick blender, which apparently does not want to do today. There we go. All right, so I have all my oils mixed, and I'll pour in my water. So it's, it's going to be a little, it's going to have a Christmas theme. Um, and I don't want to give it away just yet until I've done it. So um, I'm actually really looking forward to this one. It should be fun. It should be festive and exciting. Try to get much of that out as I can. I don't want to waste it. All right. We'll get back to stick blending. Look how black that looks, hey? How awesome. I'm just 
just see all the, I'm trying to get all the charcoal off the side of my bowl. I can see it's kind of sticking, and I want to make sure everything's blended in nicely. So I just take my spatula and I go around. There we go, and so I'll put this back in. thicker so that's what I'm looking for so now I'm going to add my essential oils in So I'm just going to make sure everything's nice and mixed in. Think about how many dishes I have after doing all this, using all the different stuff. This is my mold. Um, this is a, can make 17 bars. Um, so this is what I normally use for my soaps. And this one, like I said, is just a plain, plain charcoal bar. So I just pour it in. Oh, it smells so good. Just like like licorice with a hint of mint to it, which is awesome. Make sure you get everything out. Every little bit counts. All right. So that is in there. And then now I'm just going to tap it down so that I can get all the air bubbles out. It also makes it so it has like a little bit of a smoother surface. That's it. That is my licorice mint charcoal bar. I'm gonna try to show it to you. And there we go. So this is gonna go in the oven and then I'm hoping to be able to unmold it within the next couple days. Um, and then we can cut it and you can see what it looks like inside and I'll kind of tell you a little bit more about what I'm doing with it. Um, like I said, it's going to be one of my um, Christmas bars. And I think that you guys are really gonna like it. It smells super good. So, Put that away. And then I have a few more um, bars that I'm going to be making today. I haven't decided if I'm going to do them live or not. Um, they're a little more intricate, but it could be kind of fun. Uh, if you like seeing my live videos, um, please, 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 if you could comment and let me know that you like them, um, then I will keep making them. Uh, so yeah, I just want to thank everyone for watching, and um, I hope everyone has a great long weekend. I'm going to be busy making some Christmas soaps, so have a great day, everyone.